Hello again fellow VR users. I am making a bit of an update video on one of my previous videos on how to install the Oculus software on a separate drive. There have been a lot of questions that I feel like I could have better represented in that video and to save myself some headache with the repeated questions I will answer them here in the remake of the original video. Firstly, I will answer the most common question which is where to find your user for your path. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need to do is go to the bottom left here Go to your file explorer, go to this PC, go to your C drive, and then users. This is where you find your username. Alternatively, you could also use your Oculus setup by right clicking it, going to properties, and then you'll see a location right here, and then you can just see here what your username is. Another thing, if you see that you have OneDrive in this path, you'll need to do the following. Go to your users folder, and inside of the folder for your user, just make a folder named desktop. Okay, so you have your user, what do you do with it? The most simple part of this is probably putting in your user here, where you're just going to need to take out the epimi, and just copy and paste your user here, so let's just pretend your user is Batman. So you just type in Batman, and that's all you have to do for this. If you would also like to change the drive for your uh, installation, all you have to do is change this from D and put it to, for example, F if you want to put it on your F drive instead. So if you've followed those steps, everything from here on should be really just a breeze, unless you messed it up horribly. What you're going to need to do is just press Windows key and R to bring up this run prompt, and then just paste the uh, path right in here and press OK. I don't have the Oculus set up anymore, so I can't show what happens from here, but you'll have an admin prompt that will pop up, and then you'll have to accept the Oculus FAQ to install the software. Also, make sure that you have the Oculus software uninstalled beforehand. It has to be uninstalled before you can reinstall it on a separate drive. And that's really all there is to it. If you still have issues, you can join my Discord where I'll help people out when I have spare time to do so. The link for it, as well as my Twitch, will be in the description, and I would really appreciate it if you could support me by following me there. That's all for this video. Please like and subscribe.